Greetings, Brown family. Hope you guys are having a great time in Birmingham. We like to say thank you to the host family who is putting on the uh, event. It takes a lot of effort, dedication, and just endurance to host a large family like ours. Uh, I wanted to take an opportunity to speak with you guys on our genealogy. Sorry that the Robertson family could not make it. We had prior uh, commitments that conflicted with the dates, but um, what I have done is I've put together a slide that details all of our different ethnicities that have been tested through ancestry. I did test my mom, which is the oldest um, living uh, relative on the Brown Mount Ellis. Um, well, I don't know if she's the Ellis or Mount, but she is definitely the oldest li living relative of, uh, who is a descent, direct descendant of all of our different surnames. So with that being said, all of the, the um, ethnicities that I share with you in the slide, as well as the different languages, uh, customs, um, they are indeed part of our DNA. Um, as you know, we have a lot of different surnames other than Brown. Uh, we tend to forget about our ancestral grandparents uh, as far as the grandmother having their own names be, uh, prior to them uh, being married. So you'll see in this presentation some of the names of Grandma Hester's family. You'll see the Crow Indians and the Sioux Indians, which are part of her DNA, her Jewish roots, her German roots, her Russian roots, as well as you will see um, uh, the same for uh, Papa Mac. Now, keep in mind a lot of the DNA that they shared overlapped with each other. You'll see in a lot of um, the uh, European, um, you'll see a lot of the European uh, family uh, DNA charts and you'll see the family crest and different regions that represents our DNA. That has been proven to be part of not only my DNA, some of the other family members who have had their DNA tested, as well as mom. Now, one thing that Ancestry did say is that uh, when talking to some of the panels that do the research, as well as some of the other genealogy sites, they were just so impressed that our family has such a deep-rooted DNA map that pretty much links us to anywhere in the world. And the reason being is slave trade and the mixture of uh, the different slaves with different slave owners and the um, not only the slave owners, Native Americans and so forth. So you'll see Asian, Spanish, Portuguese, uh, various African nation, uh, Arabic, you name it. Even the Croatian Indians who um, interracially mix with some of our European ancestors on the West and Brown side, um, and then later broke off into the Choctaw Nation, Cherokee Nation, and so forth. So I hope you enjoy the video. Um, hope you guys have a wonderful time. Uh, beautiful job, host family. Thank you so much for hosting the Brown Family Reunion in Birmingham, Alabama. Um, and to um, all the family, we hope you have the best of times, have a chance to reconnect and have a safe journey home. Love you guys and see you next time.